This is the Ancient World Overview for the Medicine Through Time history course taught at Plimstock School. Your task. Based upon your learning from the overview activity, you are to place the events and the individuals identified onto your Venn diagram. In doing so, you will remind yourself of the correct period or periods that they apply to. You will remember the arrangement of the Venn diagram from your previous ancient world overview. Do the individuals or events apply to prehistoric medicine, Egyptian medicine or Greek medicine? The ten events that you need to identify and place on your Venn diagram are as follows. Trephining Hieroglyphics The Pharaohs Superstitious Ideas Hippocrates Settled communities Trained doctors Medicine man Asclepios and finally democracy please pause the film now trephining is the prehistoric operation for allowing evil spirits to escape from the head by drilling holes in the skull of the patient. Hieroglyphics is Egyptian. It's the first means by which medical information and knowledge could be written down and passed on. Pharaohs were the Egyptian rulers because Egyptian society was settled instead of nomadic like prehistoric medicine. The Egyptians needed organization and government and the pharaoh was in charge of that. Superstitious ideas is in the middle of our Venn diagram because each of the three periods is superstitious, even though it's in decline from prehistoric to Egyptian through to Greek, the Greeks are still overwhelmingly superstitious, so it's applicable to all three. Hippocrates, the father of medicine, the man who gave doctors their basic rules, was Greek and he appears here. His role will last in medicine through to the present day. Settled communities applies to the Egyptians and to the Greeks. They all stayed in one place, built cities and farmed. Prehistoric medicine and history is nomadic. People didn't stay in one place. Trained doctors is applicable to both Egyptian and to Greek medicine. Infotep being the first recorded doctor and Hippocrates being regarded as the most important doctor. The medicine man the shaman or the witch doctor applies to prehistoric medicine. The Asclepios, he was the Greek god of healing. His temples were known as Asclepia 
and they are regarded as the first hospitals. Democracy, finally, is regarded as a Greek notion. Can you please mark your answers out of 10, correct and amend, and feedback to your teacher?